the planet. We need cleaner energy sources. So a lot of people say that nowadays they want cleaner energy sources while still helping the environment, but so you would think someone would already made something like that. Well, someone already has. There's solar panels. So solar panels have been around for a long time. They're not nothing new. The only reason they seem pretty new is because now, just now, we started pushing towards using them. So now that we push towards using them, they could potentially affect all of us. So I like helping the environment. I want to help keep it clean, help stop trying to um, try to stop polluting our planet. And I'm actually very interested in how solar panels work too. By learning about solar panels. I think we can have a better understanding on how they work and how we can use cleaner energy sources to help our environment. First of all, I will be talking about the history of solar panels and how they work, the pros and cons, and how they can potentially affect you. So remember how I said at first solar, pan solar panels aren't new technology? Well, according to the US Department of Energy, they've actually been around for thousands of years, since 7th century BC. So what was the first use of solar technology? It was actually the magnifying glass. They used the magnifying glass to concentrate the sun's rays to make a fire, or to <coughs> they used to burn ants with them too. Um, so how the way solar panels actually work is that there's these little things inside them called solar cells, which they absorb the light sun rays, which then converts it into electricity, into electricity that we can use. So now that we know kind of how they work and a little background information, we can talk about the pros and cons. The pros of solar panels. So we all want cleaner energy. The pros of solar panels is that, well, first of all, we use clean energy. It's electricity that we get from the sun. So it's all environmentally friendly. They, a solar power system also creates energy silently. They can be installed on rooftops like here, and they can also, they also reduce pollution, and yeah, that's basically it. The cons of having a solar panel system is, at first, they're very, very expensive. The initial cost can go to about a thousand dollars per panel, and since most homes need a, more than one panel, it can be really expensive. The other con is that they only work during the day, since they only since they use the sun's energy. So while using so if it's not day, they can't really produce energy. Also, they don't work as well in bad weather conditions. Say there's a storm or something like that. Also, although they don't produce and they don't produce pollution, they won't work as well in polluted areas since they're not able to catch the sun's rays very efficiently. So now that I've talked about the pros and cons, how can they potentially affect us? According to an article by Miranda Green on the Daily Beast, two cities in California have passed laws that, when a, that new buildings have to include a solar powered system. Those cities are Sebastopol and Lancaster. That means that California is now pushing towards using solar panels, and since we all live in California, they affect us. So maybe later, if we buy a new house or something, we might have to have solar panels on them. <coughs> Another way they can potentially affect us is that since we might want to have solar panels now in our homes, We can act, the government can actually give us a little discount on them. Say, if someone were an early backer of these solar panel systems, the government can actually cover 30% of the cost. And since solar panels are a, a clean source of energy used by the sun, the sun is free, that means later on you can have free energy. So no more electricity bills. So now that I've talked, I've talked about the history of solar panels and how they work, how, the pros and cons, and how they can potentially affect us.
So, so by learning more about solar panels, we can actually learn how to use cleaner energy sources and help the environment. So we all want to use cleaner energy. We all want to help the environment. So why not go to for solar panels? We can help the environment and save a little money in the long run.